One sunny day, Sarah woke up early and got ready for work. She put on her favorite blue dress and grabbed her purse before leaving her apartment. As she walked to the bus stop, she saw a little girl crying on the sidewalk. The girl had dropped her ice cream cone, and it had melted all over her hands. Sarah felt sorry for the girl, so she gave her a tissue to wipe her hands, and offered to buy her a new ice cream cone. The girl smiled and thanked Sarah, and they walked to the ice cream truck together. After buying the girl a new ice cream cone, Sarah continued on her way to work. When she arrived at the office, her boss praised her for being kind to others. The rest of the day went smoothly, and Sarah was happy to have helped the little girl in need. When she got home, she made herself a cup of tea and relaxed on her couch. As she sipped her tea, she realized that even small acts of kindness can make a big difference in someone's day. She felt grateful for the opportunity to make a difference and went to bed feeling content. And now we will come to part two of this video, called Vocabulary. Grabbed, took hold of something suddenly and forcefully. Purse, a small bag used to carry money and other personal items. Sidewalk, a paved path for pedestrians at the side of a road. Melted, changed from a solid to a liquid state by heating or warming. Praised, expressed warm approval or admiration of someone or something. Acts of kindness, actions done to help others without expecting anything in return. Grateful, feeling or showing appreciation or thanks for something received or done. Content, feeling happy and satisfied with what one has, not wanting more. We are moving on to part three of the video called English Reflex, where I will ask questions related to the story and your task is to answer within three seconds, even if it's just a short and simple answer. The key to this learning method is that you have to speak and answer the questions in the video. One sunny day, Sarah woke up early and got ready for work. What did Sarah do on sunny day? Who woke up early and got ready for work? When did Sarah wake up early and get ready for work? How did Sarah get ready for work? She put on her favorite blue dress and grabbed her purse before leaving her apartment. What did Sarah put on before leaving her apartment? Who grabbed her purse before leaving her apartment? When did Sarah put on her blue dress and grab her purse? As she walked to the bus stop, she saw a little girl crying on the sidewalk. What did Sarah see as she walked to the bus stop? Who was crying on the sidewalk as Sarah walked to the bus stop? When did Sarah see the little girl crying on the sidewalk? How did Sarah feel when she saw the little girl crying on the sidewalk? The girl had dropped her ice cream cone and it had melted all over her hands. What had happened to the girl's ice cream cone? Who had dropped her ice cream cone? How did the ice cream melt all over the girl's hands? Sarah felt sorry for the girl, so she gave her a tissue to wipe her hands and offered to buy her a new ice cream cone. What did Sarah give the girl to wipe her hands? Who offered to buy the girl a new ice cream cone? How did Sarah feel about the girl dropping her ice cream cone? The girl smiled and thanked Sarah, and they walked to the ice cream truck together. What did the girl do when Sarah offered to buy her a new ice cream cone? Who walked to the ice cream truck together? How did the girl feel after getting a new ice cream cone? We have completed the first video in this learning method. And we hope you are satisfied and able to apply this method to your English learning at any time.
You can pause or rewind to listen and practice the English sentences in the lesson. Please note that this method requires perseverance and regular repetition. We recommend repeating the lesson between 7 and 21 times for the best reflexive learning effect. Thank you for watching the entire video. Goodbye and see you in the next videos.